Singapore has lauded India's historic signing of the peace accord with insurgent group Alpha, saying that it will significantly enhance foreign investments from Singapore in the northeast region. The Chief of Defence Staff visited INS Rajuli and was briefed on operational preparedness of the air station. INS Vikrant has been equipped with 100 km range MR SAM missiles, and the carrier is ready for upcoming Milan 2024 exercise. Indian Army troops in J and K have started receiving Mohindra Armado Armoured Light Specialist vehicles. India expects to receive INS Chakra 3 Akula class nuclear powered attack submarine on a long term lease from Russia by late 2025. India has sanctioned 29 new road projects in Ladakh worth 1170 crore rupees. Pakistan Air Force has decided to replace the 81.3 kN Russian RD-93MA engine on its JF-17 fighter jets with 86 kN Chinese WS-131 engine. The first edition of Exercise Desert Cyclone 2024 between the armies of India and UAE will be conducted from 2nd January to 15th January in Rajasthan, that will focus on urban operations. Hindustan Aeronautics has unveiled new details of the Cats Hunter next generation air launched cruise missile, which will weigh 700 kilograms and will feature folded wings that will enable efficient storage and integration on mothership aircraft. It will be powered by an upgraded variant of 3.43 kN PTAE 7 engine, known as PTAE 7G, that will generate 4.2 kN and will provide the necessary thrust for the missile's long range flight. The Cats Hunter has a stealth design, and the special materials will minimize its radar signature. It will mimic terrain features to remain invisible to enemy radar, making it a ghost missile in skies. The Cats Hunter will start trials in 2025, and its projected range is 350 km. The Ministry of Defence has confirmed the successful flight testing of the indigenously designed and developed integrated life support system for the pilot of the Tejas fighter jet. Indian fighter jets relied on imported liquid oxygen systems, creating dependence on foreign suppliers, that will now be replaced with the DRDO developed integrated life support system, that utilizes bleed air from the Tejas engine to generate oxygen on board. Indian Army has demonstrated its Nimbus tethered drone during the integrated firepower exercise at Pokhran. It features advanced electro-optical and infrared sensor, for persistent surveillance in both planes and the extreme super-high altitude areas environment. The Indian Army has placed a significant order for Nimbus long-endurance drones under a 250 crore rupees procurement contract and the delivery will be completed within the next few months, that will ensure real-time intelligence over critical areas for longer durations. Today's Top 3 Comments